All right, with the motor man, it's like it's like a competitive mixtape. A competitive mixtape. Y'all gotta excuse me. I'm a little bit tipsy. Matter of fact, with my cup. Hold on. It's pretty much a competitive mixtape. It's coming at a lot of people. I mean, a lot of people couldn't. If they take it offensive. They take it offensive. But at the end of the day, I'm looking at it like, nigga, like I got family to feed. I got, I got niggas that want to get on on this music shit. So this the only thing we got. You know what I'm saying? And I'm giving it my all, and I'm coming at all competitors. Whoever want to step up, step up. Get your ass eight and sit back home with the tail between your legs, all that. So that's how I'm looking at it. Fuck them all. That's that's the that's the whole point of the mixtape. Point of the mixtape. All right, all right. So, 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 what you think about these these young Chicago rappers? I think it's good. You know what I'm saying? They only rapping what they know. Some of them following, you know. Some of them following. Some of them trying to be like whoever. But I think it's good that Chief Keef he made it out the hood. But if he at the top, I want that. Whatever, quote unquote, whoever the number one rapper in Chicago, I want that. You know what I'm saying? If Chief Keef is the number one rapper, if King Louie, whoever, I want that. Rocky Fresh, I'm at you. Everybody, I'm at you. L-E-P, Bogus Boys, I'm at you. It don't matter. I want that, you know what I'm saying? So it's not nothing personal, you know what I'm saying? Because I don't know you, you know what I'm saying? Where I'm from, if you get personal, niggas get shot and killed and stabbed and beat up, you know what I'm saying? Don't take the glass too lightly anyway, you know what I'm saying? This is the persona you can remember. But I'm saying like, I'm at you. We MCs, we rappers. Don't, like, ain't no spot final, nigga. Like, if you think you comfortable, don't get comfortable. Cause a nigga like me will that that came from nothing will come up and snatch your shit. And that's why I'm coming, that's what I'm doing with Geek Though. That's all I'm saying. That's that's what I'm having everybody saying. Geek though. Like man, you ain't heard Geek though. Like, oh, you fuck with it? No, you ain't heard Geek though. Oh, so you think your listeners go get the message? Oh, they gonna get it. A retarded motherfucker get this. Uh, what else? What else you had to say? I mean. Before I get off this camera, I just want everybody to decide. Decide what's good and what's bad. You know what I'm saying? Don't sit there and listen to the beat and just nod your head. Decide and listen. You know what I'm saying? What's cold and what's not. Don't be stupid. Don't let these niggas make money off of stupid shit and dumb shit. You know what I'm saying? It, I mean, I don't got no problem with a nigga feeding their family. But when it comes to being competitive, and, and me want to do better for the whole culture, decide. You should want to do better for your culture. Because if rap come out like disco, which is, don't exist in 2013, disco music does not exist in 2013. So if hip hop or rap or whatever turn out to be disco, niggas like you that's watching this video that don't have nothing just like I don't have right now, do not have a chance. So decide. If you want, if you gonna go hard for your culture, or you just gonna bullshit and put out anything, decide. I just thought of the, uh, the name of the, of the website. 